A summary of the Pilgrim's Guide to Garabandal. This new product is a virtual guide for those visiting Garabandal and also for those interested in learning more about the apparitions in this mountain village. It is intended for you to use at opportune moments and places during your visit and enables you to download the information you need as a lasting record of your pilgrimage. Taking advantage of this fact, the fact that we all have a mobile device or a cell phone, we can review the information in this guide not only at the time of our visit, but at our leisure in more detail whenever we want. The information here is structured in logical stages to make your visit real and immediate. We can call the first stage on the road to Garabandal. The second stage describes the village of Garabandal, a village in the mountains. In the third stage, we talk about the Kaleha and the prophecy of the warning. And in the fourth stage, we discuss the pines, the miracle, and the punishment or chastisement, as it is sometimes called. And lastly, there is a fifth stage that touches on other prophecies and other references to Garabandal. All the information is logically structured in stages. The content by which our visit to this wondrous place is unfolded consists of almost 600 thematic slides. This guide provides you with the help of a virtual expert who is right there with you at the time of your visit and beyond that, an expert who is there with you at whatever other time or place you may find yourself after your visit when you feel the need to delve deeper into the meaning of the apparitions. This guide gives you immediate access to virtual content. There are people who download it right there on the spot in Garabandal. The guide will accompany you and fit itself to your own personal rhythm during the visit. This is because there are people who make it a two-day visit while others spend only mere hours in Garabandal. In this way, each person can use the information as suits them best, at their own individual pace, attending to aspects that are most important to them. After that, you can review and view uh, and even print out whatever themes matter most to you at your leisure. Or you can integrate all this wealth of information with your own photos by way of voice notes or as part of an album that records your visit. You can indeed share your experiences with other users or view the comments of other pilgrims in a special forum dedicated to the Pilgrim's Guide to Garabandal. Also, if you have any further questions, you can get online support by email with answers given by expert moderators. The guide has maps that give you pertinent locations along with photographs that orient you to where everything is, as well as orthophotos of where you can go that have been edited with superimposed information that includes slope profiles, topographical contours, and other information. The guide has aerial photographs that have been edited and that feature the main places where the apparitions occurred along with ortho photos similarly edited. The guide includes photographs of the Caleja, the Pines, the place of the Milagruco. In every respect, it is a complete guide to help make your visit the most fruitful and satisfying possible. And to top things off and make it complete, the guide includes a schedule of liturgical celebration and worship in the village and all the other nearby towns and villages if you need this for your visit. In addition to the information that is immediately pertinent to your visit, other contents of the guide allow you to enter more deeply into a knowledge of the apparitions and the transcendent relevance of their message. These other rich ramifications of the guide 
can also be consulted during the visit because they are structured to reflect the stages by which the visit itself to Garabandal is organized. This guide contains information that has been sifted and analyzed with up-to-date information. It's like having an expert by your side to help you deepen your appreciation of our current world situation and the message of Garabandal through the study and witness of experts and others. There are almost 600 thematic slides filled with an abundance of graphics. It's like reading a compilation of the best published pieces on this fascinating subject. The writing is entertaining and simple, an easy approach to a serious, compelling theme by way of slides that read like extracts from the best of the published material that exists on Garabandal. As mentioned earlier, the information is constantly updated, and this guide will always give you ready access to the latest material. The graphic material contained in this guide is exclusive and original, a fact that makes it doubly interesting. The content of the guide revolves around the events that occurred and their social and historical context. There are photos that capture certain moments, photos of how the girls were at the beginning and at the end of the apparitions. There is statistical data to compare the moment of the apparitions to the world of today, drawing a contrast between Spain as it was at that time and as it is today. In addition, there are deeply thought out explanations of the supernatural phenomena that occurred during the apparitions. There is an in-depth examination of the spiritual message of Garabandal, starting with the Eucharist and going on to consider the rosary that Our Lady joined them in reciting so many times, teaching them how to pray. And then there is the Eucharist administered in invisible communions brought by the angel. This goes hand in hand with an insistence on the Eucharist as a focal point, as well as the importance of sacrifice. There is information on the states of ecstasy, as well as information concerning the families of the visionaries. And we're not only dealing with the spiritual message, but also the eschatological message that is so typical of Garbandal and that is sometimes forgotten, as are the facts of the warning, the miracle, and the era of peace. There are explanations of what the warning may consist of, of what the complexion of the miracle may be, all of this being contrasted with other scientific topics and other spiritual themes and messages. This includes what Our Lady has said in other apparitions in a similar fashion, and with what sacred scripture says about all these topics. These issues are not exclusive to Garabandal, but it's as if Garabandal in Garabandal, things that were already there and existing were recalled to human memory and brought back to mind, which is why these events mirror both sacred scripture and the prophets, all of whom talk about the warning, the miracle, and the era of peace. There is also information about other prophecies, such as the prophecy about the number of popes. There is also included information that deals with a topic that Conchita began talking about in Garabandal, about the end of time. What is the end of time? We, re we recognize that the end times are not the end of the world, and the period of communism that will be coming before the warning which is also predicted in sacred scripture and other places. Finally, the guide also contains all the information on the 15 diocesan statements that have been issued and that are not in agreement in their assessment. To this day, the last statement says that there does not appear to be a supernatural aspect to Garabandal, and comparison is made with the declarations of holy popes of six saints who have defended this message and wished it to be spread far and wide. These include Saint Padre Pio and Saint Jose and Maria Escrivar, as well as blesseds and venerables. When all is said and done, 
there are many saints and venerables in the church who have commented favorably on the appearances of Garbandal. And lastly, there is also an analysis of the message in its relationship with Holy Scripture and with approved Marian apparitions. Comparisons are made with the secret of La Salette, with the secret of Fatima, with the apparitions of Amsterdam, and with the apparitions of Guadalupe. All of this makes Garabandal supernaturally significant, integral to a message larger than itself, and more than just a phenomenon limited to one time and place. Finally, there are bibliographical references, sites and links where you can download books about the apparitions. There is information about the recent film about Garabandal. God knows, alas, that the film lacks an eschatological message, but nevertheless, it gives a good portrayal of the basic facts. Mention is made of a doctoral thesis recently written by the film's scriptwriter, a document that has similar deficiencies in the way it conveys the message of Garabandal. We talk about the book titled Garabandal 50 Years Later, which, on the contrary, is oriented to the entire spiritual and eschatological message of the apparitions. This entire guide is composed of two parts that you can download at www.garabandal.org.es. Click on Downloads and Bookstore. There are versions in English and Spanish. I have nothing more to say. Thank you very much for listening. It is my wish that events of Garabandal touch your heart and soul as they have touched mine.